Hello, this is Nuki. This is Mixwell and this is the official power ranking from Masters Iceland. Powered by Aegon by AOC. start with uh, the guard. I put him then in the top tier because you know they've won some good teams online. They play really good and uh, I'm excited to see that if they can do it the same online. I'm not sure about guards. I was hyped about them at the start but I always remember one thing that they are young kids which will take some time to readjust to land and it will be a difficult time from my experience. The guard, I would put them in tier two. I don't want to put them in tier one, but they have that factor like tier two. So yeah, you can go either way. Like they'll do really good or really bad. Uh, paper X, paper X, paper X. We cracked against them. So first thoughts was it felt a bit very weak at the start. I don't know how. Maybe our region is just too advanced in that area that we play a lot more. We're a bit individually better, but or more experience because we have more scenes coming to you, but for y'all, I would put Paper X in Tier 3. I would put Paper X in Tier 3, just because I saw them play and I know that they have really good individuals, but uh, as a team they don't play as well as probably other regions. Um, they could upset for sure, but uh, I don't think they will win the event. Loud, I would probably put in Tier 2. I feel like they're pretty strong individually from what I've seen. Um, and they can be threats as well. They have good players actually. They have that Saki guy, he's really, really good. I'll put him on, I'll put them on, sorry, on tier two. They can upset. Loud from Brazil, everyone is hyping them up. Uh, I watched how they play, they have a, a super team from their country. If I, I've, if I have to choose, I would put them on tier two. Uh, Liquid, it's a hard team because they're so unpredictable. It's hard to put them somewhere. I would put them between tier one and tier two because they are really good individually, but sometimes their picks are a bit unusual. So it's hard to say, but uh, somewhere between tier one, tier two. And Liquid, I'll put them on tier one as well. They're really, really good. I feel like all the EVA <laughs> teams is uh, tier one. Next is DRX. Ooh. <laughs> I have so many top tier teams. Everyone is just so good. Uh, probably top tier as well. I like how they play. They are robots. <laughs> DRX, I think it's the best team in terms of uh, tactics. Super disciplined. They've been together for a while. Slags is a really good IGL. Uh, it's a tough opponent when you don't know anything about them. It's easier when you see them play. I would place them tier 1 just because they are solid. DRX, tier 1 as well. These guys are crazy good. Like, they have so many strats, like, they're so tactical. And it feels a lot more different than playing against other teams. So, yeah, they figured this stuff out. Next is Optic. <laughs> I'm not a top tier team. <laughs> oh, yeah. But, yeah, Optic. We know how they play. We have seen them. They are a good team. Optic Gaming, I would put them on tier 1 as well, because they've been playing really well on, online in NA, they've been dominating, they've been uh, together for a while as well. They have a really good core, a good IGL on FNS, and they're one of the favorites to win the tournament. Zeta Division, I would also put in tier 3. I feel like their individual skill also is a bit on the lower side from what I've seen from the Japanese teams from before. And now I feel like uh, it's not on par with the, the other regions just yet, at least. And Zerta is kind of the same with them. I have the same feeling that they're kind of between tier two, tier three. They can maybe upset one team, but it's going to be hard for them, to be honest. Cool. And one question if the final is going to be G2 versus anybody, who mm. do you think it's going to be and why? If the final would be G2 versus someone, I would probably say the guard, because as I said, their individual skill is insane. I'll probably pick against Optic, because I don't want another EU versus EU team. Kind of like Gambit versus Ascent on, in Champions. It was kind of boring to be honest to watch, because they've played against each other a lot. So I'd like to see an EU versus NA or EU versus Latsum or something like that. 
something different. 